Hello and welcome to our Magura video workshop. In this video I will explain how to fill and bleed your Magura disc brake. After the removal of the wheel, fully push back the pistons using the Magura transport device. Afterwards, unscrew the pad fitting screw using a 2mm Allen key and remove the brake pads from the caliper. Now put the white part of the transport device in between the pistons and secure it into place with a rubber band to keep it from falling out during the process of bleeding. Open the bleeding screw and insert the prepared syringe tightening it slightly with an 8mm open-ended wrench. Turn the master cylinder to an elevation of approximately 15 degrees and fix it in position by tightening the clamp bolt slightly. Remove the EBT screw and insert a syringe without piston into the EBT port. Push oil through the system until there are no more bubbles rising in the empty syringe. Draw the, the oil back into the lower syringe and then push oil upwards a second time and let the lever snap two or three times while maintaining the pressure on the lower syringe to remove any remaining bubbles from the seals of the master caliper. After removing the upper syringe, put a small amount of oil upwards to fill the EBT port completely, then insert and tighten the EBT screw. Now remove the syringe from the caliper and close the caliper quickly. Remove the transport device and clean the caliper carefully, removing all the residues of oil or grease. Put the brake pads back into the caliper and secure them with a brake pad fitting screw. To finish the process, check for function and possible leakages by pressing the brake lever several times.